Hey guys, it's Carter from Wheel of Fire Alarms here, and today I will be showing you guys this new radiation alarm that I got. All right, so um, my dad's uh, company is moving and he's clearing out all his old safety equipment. And they, um, in his company, they deal with some radioactive materials. So um, one of the things they got rid of was a radiation alarm. As you can see, it's right here in front of me. It comes with four different parts. It comes with um, the alarm part itself right there. It comes with a little box comes with the cords and then it has this awesome radiation sign here. Um, I have no idea how to wire this thing um, or how it works at all. Uh, it just kind of showed up. Um, I'm wearing gloves because this thing has been in oil refineries and who knows what toxic goop it has on it and it's really dirty too so we're going to clean it. Um, so today we're going to uh, go ahead and clean it off and hopefully get uh, this thing to run. All right, so um, I took that metal cover off the top just to clean it, and just look how nasty that is. That's so gross. Oh my god, ew. Well, we're going to get this thing a really good cleaning here. Hey, look, so now we can see the labels here. It looks like um, there's a test position. There's a switch up here, part of the airplane. Um, looks like there's a switch here and you can turn it to test or on or off. So that's kind of cool. I never noticed that underneath all the gunk. And we'll continue to clean this out. And there we go, it's good as new. What do you guys think? So it looks like it's made by Tech, OPS, and Gamma Alarm. And here's all the inspection stuff. Um, <laughs> 1995, so this thing's pretty old. This is, I don't really know. I imagine this is the power connection. That would be my guess. Come on, let's see, yep, this is the power connection. And then it looks like this port here will plug into that, and that will give power to the alarm. So, I think we have this figured out how to wire it up, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. All right, so everything is cleaned off, and everything is wired up uh, the way it logically should go. I don't know what these cables are. I imagine they're probably go to like a battery charger or something because um, there's no port for them on either of these uh, boxes here. So uh, I have this plugged into a GFCI outlet so in case something happens it will shut it off. And um, I have everything in the off position for now and we're gonna go ahead and plug it in. And this light is, turns on here and we'll push it to test. Hey, what about that? That's kind of cool. Wow, isn't that neat? Turn it on. And I don't know what happens when it's in the on position. So it looks like what happens when you push it to the test position is the um, sounder goes off in the high-low tone and uh, the red beacon flashes. So that's kind of cool. I wonder how the yellow beacon flashes. I wonder what makes it do that. Um, well, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video on this radiation alarm. Um, look forward to more videos soon uh, on it. I'm going to do a series on it probably. And with that being said, like the video, leave comments, and of course, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.